Saturday morning. Welcome back. But this heavy rain, it always makes me want to mm -hmm. sleep in, you know? <laughs> I don't know what it is, the pressure or it's, something. It's going to be a good day to take a nap if you're lucky enough. I know I might. I've been up last <laughs> night a lot later than I should you're have watching that to. Badgers game. Oh, that was a tough one. But hey, oh. awesome to see them in the Sweet 16 yes. once again. And congratulations. They weren't expecting that. Yeah, congratulations to those seniors too. Fond du Lac, 14 hundredths of an inch of rain last night. That seems to be one of the higher amounts. Again, very light rain amounts so far, but I think we're just getting going uh, with this system. Uh, this is a live look in Kenosha where we have a temperature of 38 degrees and a light rain falling in Kenosha. Currently in Milwaukee, it's 38 degrees and northeast winds at 16 miles per hour this morning. Now, along with the rain, we're going to have that stiff northeast breeze through our day today, making things feel pretty chilly out there. It's going to be a cold rain. 36 in Waukesha, 40 in Burlington, 38 in Racine, and 36 currently in Port Washington. Let's go through the weather headlines. Now a soggy weekend expected. Not only today, but tomorrow we're going to have this rain. Rainfall amounts could be over an inch by the time things are over with by tomorrow evening. Well, not completely over with. We might have a lingering shower still to go on Monday. You'll see that on the seven day, but also windy at times these next couple of days. The storm for max radar across southeastern Wisconsin. Yeah, we still have some light showers indicated by this light green. This is really light stuff for the most part. Now it does get a little bit heavier down to the south of us across Illinois and working its way around an area of low pressure tightening across the plains. Uh, you can see some heavier rain to the northwest of Kansas City. So you can see by 1030, I think the rain starts to pick up during the late morning hours again across pretty much the entire viewing area. Now as we head into this afternoon and evening, more bands of rain working their way in here from the southeast and yeah, maybe even some heavier pockets of rain later on tonight and during the day on Sunday. This is 2.30 a.m. in the morning, scattered showers, and then during the day on Sunday, again, you get the idea. More showers moving through. It's going to be on and off soggy all weekend long. How much rain are we talking about? Now, recent computer model runs have kind of backed off on the rain amounts. Uh, this run here showing less than an inch for most of the area, maybe a little bit more uh, down towards Racine and Kenosha. But I would say in general, everybody's got a good shot of at least picking up an inch of rain. Your forecast for today, a high temperature of 42 degrees, cloudy and breezy with periods of rain expected through our day today. For tonight, a low temperature holding steady at 40 degrees with patchy fog and periods of rain and here's your seven day forecast now. Sunday still soggy 50 degrees. I guess at least it's warmer on Sunday 50 degrees 50 on Monday a slight chance of showers on Monday. That system really starting to exit by then now 46 on Tuesday with partly cloudy skies Wednesday mostly sunny and 46 not a bad early spring a uh, couple days there on Tuesday and Wednesday and then a chance of showers on Thursday 45 and then up to 48 next week on Friday, Julia. I can't be mad about the temperatures, but now the weather is not so great. So <laughs> pretty gray out there. Yeah, thanks so much.